Hey people, me again. I know. Now, yes, about this Italian speaking video. Pardon the brain farts I had and the slow hesitancy coming out of it. I did want to say more, and trust me, I can do better than that. I can do way better than that than I did there. Oops, sorry, somebody messaged me on Facebook. It's one of my friends. Pardon me. Oh, good God. Sorry, I just happened to see something in my news feed. Well, anyway, pardon to any of the Italians I may have offended, because it's apparent I had defended one. Offended one. I didn't mean to. Now, yes. I know my accent probably did not sound as good as it could have. I am trying to work on that. And yes, 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 I now, the person, I will put that person's name, I'll put that scream name down below, or, nah, I won't do that. Well, anyways, yes, yes, I do agree, you who has responded in that way. I do agree that you should learn with a native speaker. I agree that much. That much I do agree, and that much I do agree that the what I did say didn't sound too good. Because it didn't sound as fluent as it could have. I agree there too. I agree fully. Very disgusting performance. I know, I'm gonna try to relax more. Just, guys, keep in mind that that was the first time before the world that I had spoke some words of another language. Before the camera, in front of the whole wide world. Just remember. Just keep that in mind. I have never done it before. And trust me, it was nerve-wracking, and I had several, several brain farts. I just wanted to let y'all know that. Well, anyways, without further ado, if you want more of this, I'll do a phrase of the day. A foreign language phrase of the day in both, if you want, Italian and Spanish, but I'll do one. Today... Acting out a scene from my book. So, here it goes. Hmm. See, Dante. See, Dante. See, c'è qualcuno che ruba. Sempre. Yeah. Yes, I know. What the time? Yeah. Okay. That was a little bit of a scene from the movie, from the book. In the bathroom, where I bet with the gloved hand, 
You can guess which character that is. I have a the glove on the other hand. Ah, whatever. Although the one glove was on the right hand, but... I'll do it on the left hand. Just for kicks. I had the gloves on my hands because my fingers are cold. Anyway, I'm sure you could tell by the right hand, by the gloved hand, who which character that is. Oh, yes, which brings us to this. Do you remember Marco? Marco? Uh, my character? The MJ lookalike character of John Marco Derani from Florence? That's who I was reenacting. But, now there's one catch. I would not go as him for Halloween until I have mastered the Italian language. Oh, yes. Which brings us to this. I will be picking that up in college. As well as picking the Spanish back up. That will mean I'll, that means I'd be studying those two languages in conjunct at the same time. As they are so similar to each other, the Italian, due to my heritage. Those of y'all that don't know, I actually have Italian heritage. Mostly, that is. Not all the way. But I could easily pass off as that. Or Latina, or Greek. I can't really trace my lineage to a certain part of it, but... Mom and Grandma had said somewhere in the South. Mother said maybe in the North. I don't know if I could ever obtain those records from Ellis Island. Because it's probably they did. My ancestors come from Ellis Island. There's, hold on a minute. <laughs> Sorry, friend messaging me again. Hold on. Yeah, this person I just met, this person does not know I do videos, but I will be telling that person. Yes, and any Italians that watch this, try not to get offended at all, because now you know my heritage. Plus, the good news is, I am going to be picking up the Italian language and studying it formally in college, in conjunction with Spanish. Because, like, for the reasons already mentioned. Plus, it'll also be part of a ma a part of two language minors, or perhaps a double major, and maybe have the minor with music. Hold on, again, one. Yes, now. Any Italian viewers, remember, I am learning the language, too. Now, be careful now. And try to watch how you word things. Because the wording in that previous comment was a bit jarring and a little offensive. Well, anyways. And watch your words. Yes, I hope that no it's Italian viewers actually from Italy will get offended at my attempt with the language because I am learning the language the best I can. And I bet you didn't know this, but I practiced this with some of my pen pals as well. Well, typing. Well, anyhow. Pardon the one glove thing on some of my left hand. And now, and now you guys know I'm an I'm also I'm a Michael Jackson fan as well. 
And yes, I've read up on him very well, and no, he didn't hurt any children. Not at all. No. Oh, did, you ain't gonna believe this, but, not, some of you are not gonna believe this, but the truth is, those allegations were actually extortion attempts by Evan Chandler. You see, I'll get into that in another video. I don't want to get into it too much because I don't want to waste all the time. So, yeah. Uh, the sequins aren't on the glove, but it has printing on the bottom of it. So, grips. So, yeah. Put the other one back on. Back. So I don't look like MJ. My hair kind of looks like his anyway, although mine's brown. <sighs> yeah. So, yes, if you want more phrases of the day... And you also want some reenactments of my book to increase the hype? Do let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys. Bye!